Hey everyone, today we are starting the One Pack Pokemon League. What is the One Pack Pokemon League, you ask? It's something that I made up myself. The rules are like this. Each box has eight packs. I'm gonna open up one pack from each box per week. Then, depending on prices from tgcplayer.com, we are gonna see what box has the best pulls that week. Best pull gets six points. Five points for second, all the way down to one point for sixth. We're gonna go eight weeks, total points at the end of the year win. Tiebreaker will be the overall amount pulled. We're really only gonna look at the reverse slot and the rare slot. The rest, the commons and like uncommons, I really don't wanna count, I'm sure it'll help. Every last penny's gonna count. So we're gonna really get down to it. Um, let's look at our competitors. Before we get started, I want to give away this. This is a Black Star promo Mewtwo. One of my favorite cards uh, growing up. I got a couple and I want to give one away to y'all. I am going to go down here, give uh, give you guys a, a little look-ski. Um, all you got to do is like this video. You also have to comment below who you think is going to win. And third, you have to subscribe. I don't care what order you do it in. You can do whatever the heck you want. Subscribe, like, comment. I will do it at the end of the series. Uh, this Black Star promo is going to one of you guys for free on me. What a guy. Uh, we have six boxes here and we're gonna go through them first. First is the Darkness Ablaze ETB. That stands for Elite Trainer Box. You'll hear me say ETB plenty of times. I'm trying to get rid of the reflection, but that will kind of go away once we get rid of the plastic. This was $34 and the top three cards are the Charizard VMAX, uh, Salamance VMAX, and Caesar VMAX. You'll see the cards on the screen uh, as I do this. So this is probably gonna be my pick to get in the last place. I They don't really have alt arts or really huge pulls. The Charizard's obviously a huge pull, but uh, we will hope to get our, our money back at the least for this. Next up, we have Battle Styles. Uh, this box was $36, top three cards, Tyranitar alt art, Rapid Strike, and Single Strike Urshifu alt arts as well. First um, box in descending order that will have alt arts in this competition. Uh, third up, we have Chilling Rain, this box, $34, Elite Trainer box, eight packs to it, like I said. Um, the first box that has a potential for huge pulls, like I said, $34 for the box, and top three cards, Blaziken, Altart, Galarian Moltres, Altart, and Golden Snorlax. Those three cards are all $80 and above, going raw, ungraded. We have the Fusion Strike Elite Trainer Box. For overall design, this might be the coolest design, but I've had horrible luck with Fusion Strike. $37 for the box. Um, and Altarts are the top three, Espeon, Gengar, and Mew. Plenty of Mew Altarts in here, and Top three cards are all above 70 bucks. Now the box that has the potential for the biggest card of the competition. One of the newest sets, Brilliant Stars. This box is $42 and it's, it's, it is the most expensive box. Charizard Altart for $176 at the time of this recording. Raw is the creme de la creme of the competition. Charizard Altart, Rainbow Charizard is second and then an Arceus V? I am sorry, I really don't know the exact... I've heard Arceus and Arceus, so I'm sorry about that, Arceus, Arceus fans. Please forgive me, just tell me in the comments below. And last but not least, the most recent set, Astral Radiance. Um, this box was $34, and the top three cards are all alt arts as well. Machamp, Dialga, and Palkia. So there you have it, everyone. All the boxes are ahead of you. As you can tell by the shininess and the reflections and the shadows here, they're all sealed. Let's get into cracking open these boxes. In the most professional way possible, I'm gonna do it with a very cheap pen cap, uh, cause that's how I do things. First up, we will crack open Darkness Ablaze, just so everyone can see it was sealed. And then next we will do Battle Style. Sorry if the uh, camera's a, a, a little shaky, I'm doing this on my dog's kennel. All right, I just, I, I'm just gonna show you the seal. Open. Uh, pretty nice. It was 
<laughs> it, it's pretty nice. Um, as you can see here, all of the sleeves are out, so you can kind of see, because like Astral Radiance over here is kind of hard to read. What we're going to do is we're just going to go oldest to newest, um, and we're going to get things going right now. First pack is going to be out for everybody. So we're going one, two, three, four, five, six. Here are the players, everybody. The players are out. Darkness Ablaze, Battle Styles, Chilling Rain, Fusion Strike, Brilliant Stars, Astral Radiance. I'm freaking out, guys. I've never pulled an alt art, so... If I do, you'll see a grown man poop his pants. Live on YouTube. I poop my pants! First off... It's Darkness of Blaze. First off, it's Darkness of Blaze. I cannot get this open. Okay. Patrick, for all of these, since they're all... Sword and Shield is going to be... Um... Four cards. So basically what you do... What does that mean? You go one, two, three, four to the front, and then you this last card is going to be the rare. Here we go. So we have an energy. Turbo patch. Old PC. I'm bumping. I'm bumping left and right, y'all. Doug Trio. It's cool. Snubble. I love when Snubble came out growing up. Tauros is an incredibly lifelike Tauros card. Incredible. It's not it's a thing. Rikidi, Galarian Mr. Mime. Somehow Mr. Mime got creepier. Electric. The reverse is a reverse common Skarmory. Not looking good. Not looking good. We're basically only going to put value into it if it's a rare. You got to bring the heat on the reverse. And an Arctazolt. It is a hollow. It is a hollow, so that is big. That is what Battle Styles is bringing to the table. I will take this out of the sleeve um, later after the video series, but for for ceremony reasons, ceremony reasons. Next up, we have Battle Styles. It has the Tyranitar um, art. Is that a sign? We have a Water Energy, Cheryl. Bisharp, Thebes, Mawile, Spoink, <laughs> Galarian, Mr. Mime, creepy as always, Scatterbug, Yamper, full on just swallowing his house, his captor, I don't know what you can really call that, a Spoopa, Spoopa Uncommon. Not ideal, but probably more than the common from last time. And the rare is an Aegislash non-hollow. Not ideal. Again, I'm taking this right out of the sleeve once this uh, round's done. But it's going in the sleeve for ceremony reasons. I keep wanting to say ceremonious, but I don't. Which is just the silliest little thing. Okay. Next up, Chilling Rain. I don't know why I'm so nervous. <laughs> I am so nervous. What if if any of you guys pick Darkness to Blaze or Battle Styles? Can't be happy with that first that first round. Okay, Clobopus is there on the front. One, two, three, four. Here we go. I'm sure if you guys watch Leonhart, it's trademark patented. Guess the energy is fun. I'm not doing it. It's trademark and patent. Okay. Fighting. Old Cemetery. Steeny? Sine? This is, a. Uh, I don't know why I have no idea how to say that. Dyna Tree Hill. Calabapus. Cast Form. Snowy. Haptiana. Aeron. Ralt. I believe the, this is the reverse. It is a reverse Ladybug common. And a Galarian Sir Fetched is the rare. Non hollow. It's going in the sleeve. An absolute tough start to Battle Styles, Chilling Rain, and Darkness of Blaze. I really personally have bad luck with ETBs, which is hilarious that I'm doing a whole video series on them. 
Um, next up, we have Fusion Strike. Plenty of Altar. It's a lot of opportunity here. And yet, I've, I've had horrible luck in the past. Am I trying to speak it out of existence? I am. Um, and we're halfway through the first round. Nothing impressive yet. But that's where this ends. Right here with Fusion Strike. Leaf Energy. Spongy Gloves. Frost Moth. Simiseer. Very trippy artwork. A set of keys. Pan Sage. Wooloo. Folks, I think I see something. It's our first pull! Pancham. Galarian Darumaka. The reverse is a Snom. Common, but that's okay because I think we have a Rillaboom VMAX! Whew. The Rillaboom VMAX. By far the best we've pulled so far. Fusion Strike, I have had horrible luck, but the Rillaboom VMAX is by far the best. Very cool card. I don't think I've ever pulled that card before. So the Snom Reverse uh, gets a little company. Brilliant Stars is our penultimate player for round one. Week one, round one, whatever you want to call it at home. I'm sure you're sitting down and watching this with your family and friends or all watching on your own devices to get more views and I really appreciate that. One, two, three, four, and then Brilliant Stars. Week one performance is off. Double Turbo Energy. Kindler. Sharon's Care. Starly. Milkery. Carablast. Clefairy. Cherubi. The reverse is a Carablast common and the rare is a Flygon non-hollow. Wow. My pick to win the whole thing was Brilliant Stars. And a non-hollow is the first card, is the first rare, is the first rare card that they're bringing to the table. And then our final pack of the week is Astral Radiance. This, uh, is, this, this is the newest set. It's got the chance of a double hit pack. It has plenty of alt arts. Um, lots of opportunity here for Astral Radiance. We're going one, two, three, four, and off we go. Energy. Super effective glasses. Bronzong. Very cool artwork. Again, trippy. Duat. Hisuian Growlithe. Bergmite. If you play Legend Arceus, five million of these are caught. Rufflet. Ponyta. Chatot. The reverse is a reverse rare Togekiss. That is going to be big. And a non-hollow Regirock. Okay. So the... the is it Togekiss? Is it Togekiss? Togepi Togekiss, right? I don't even know which one I'm going to put. I guess just to keep it consistent, I'm putting this in there. So here are the standings. Fusion Strike with an early lead, followed by Darkness Ablaze, Astral Radiance, Battle Styles, Brilliant Stars, and Chilling Rain. And that's it, guys. Thanks for joining week one. Uh, we got seven more weeks ahead of us. I We're going to make some big money. That's what people do, pulling Pokemon cards, all right? It's all about money. It's easy to make your money back. And I can't wait to see how we do it. Thanks for joining me. Subscribe, like, comment. I don't know, shoot me a DM. I don't know. I, it's cool. I'm having fun. Um, win this at the end of the season, and I will catch you guys in week two. I love you.